Hey everyone, this is uh, Patty Abel and Donnie Abel from Abel Wellness, and we're just coming to you today uh, to show you a few plank variations. So once you've gotten to that point that you can hold a plank, which Donnie's going to show us, holding a full plank versus our knee plank. So when you can hold a full plank, um, you can add on some variations. So the first variation Donnie's going to add is just a simple shifting forward and then rocking back. So this is still good to help continue to warm up the core and gives you some flexibility and movement in the feet and some shifting and so that continues strength in the shoulders. So he's still, if you can see, keeping his belly lifted, his solar plexus, crown of the head, tip of the tails reaching away from each other so there's no bobbing of the tush up and down. And then from here, he could add on, as he rocks forward, a foot can lift. And as he rocks back, the foot lowers down. So if you notice, the only thing that's happening is just a shifting in the shoulders and a lifting of the foot. In the torso, nothing's changing. Good. And then from here, Donnie's gonna show us a side plank. So a side plank's still good to help us with that uh, balance. That, um, but then we're going to add a little bit of oblique work. So today all we're going to do is a good side plank on the forearm. So Donnie's going to be on the forearm with it a little bit under his shoulder or a little bit further out. His feet right now are one in front of the other and then when he's ready he's going to lift his low waist and float his hips up. So what we're looking for is head in line with the spine and the hips. So the head's not jutting forward and the spine is in one nice long line. So the hips not dipping down or pressing too far up. He can also do this one with the front foot stacked on top of the back foot. And it's the exact same, same thing. If you needed to modify this at first, you can also bend the bottom knee He's just gonna bend his bottom foot back and he's gonna be on that knee and then the top leg's gonna be long. And so now he has that support of the bottom knee to help him find this lift and start strengthening up this low waist. He's also on all these pushing up and away from the floor with his arm. So he's not sinking or dropping into the shoulder like so. Good, so this is a few variations that you can add um, to start out with. And then in about a week or so, we'll put another video out with some more advanced add-ons to your plank. So um, have fun and plank on.